Hey, boys and girls. Uh, today we're going to read a story from the Big Disney Book Storybook Collections. And this one is called The Three Little Pigs. Anybody remember The Three Little Pigs? Here we go. Once upon a time, there were three little pigs. The pigs were brothers who had been living in the same house. They decided they were old enough to build homes of their own. They set off down the road. The first little pig did not like to work at all. He soon found a spot for his house. He decided to build it out of straw because that was the fastest way. When he was done, he danced down the road to see how his brother's house was coming along. The second little pig did not like to work either, so he decided to make his house out of sticks. It would be quick and easy. Before long, he was finished. His house was not very strong, but at least his work was done. The first little pig played the flute while his brother played the fiddle and danced. After a while, the two pigs went down the road to see their other brother. The third little pig was the serious one. He wanted his house to be strong and did not mind working hard. For he knew that in the nearby woods there lived a big bad wolf who liked nothing better than to catch little pigs and eat them. So he built his house out of bricks. He worked and worked, putting each and every brick carefully in place. The first two pigs laughed when they saw their brother hard at work, but the third little pig just ignored them and continued to build his house. You can laugh and dance and sing, he called after his brothers as they went back to their houses. But I'll be safe and you'll be sorry when the wolf comes to the door. The first pig was sitting inside his house of straw when the wolf came knocking at the door. Little pig, little pig, let me in, cried the wolf. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin, shouted the little pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in, roared the wolf. He took a deep breath and blew the straw house down. Not one piece was left standing. The poor little pig ran down the road to his brother's house. Soon after he got to the house of sticks, the wolf knocked on the door. He knew that the pigs would not let him in. So he disguised himself as a sheep. Luckily, the two pigs could tell it was the wolf. You can't fool us with that sheepskin, they cried. Then I'll huff and puff and blow your house in, yelled the wolf. And he blew the little house of twigs all to pieces. The two pigs raced off to their brother's brick house and hid under the bed. Don't worry, the third little pig said to his brothers. You are safe here. Soon they were laughing and playing music. The wolf could hear the little pigs having fun inside, so he decided to blow the house down. Then the pigs would have nowhere to run and hide. He huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed. But no matter how hard he tried, he could not blow down that little house of bricks. <gasps> oh, it's really tough. He's turning blue. The wolf thought and thought about how he could get inside. Then he realized he could climb down the chimney. And so he did. But the three little pigs were ready for him. A kettle of Boiling water was hanging in the fireplace. Yow! The wolf yelled as he fell into the hot water. He flew straight up the chimney and ran into the woods. The three little pigs never saw him again. The next day, the three pigs went to work again. They built two more brick houses, so each little pig would have a nice, strong house of his own. The end.